show you this little puppy right here. I just acquired this. This is a golden eagle. I forget the year. I want to say 2003. I, I really want to say that. 2003. So this is a all solid guitar. Golden Eagles are all solid. Heritage Golden Eagle. This is the competition to the L5. Now it's a stellar, beautiful guitar. Okay, 25 and a half inch scale length, ebony fretboard, solid uh, spruce top, solid maple sides and back. Look at the this guitar. Very, very pretty. <laughs> you can. You can see the tree right there, can't you? Now this has the five-piece neck. These are all also numbered. You can see the number on that. You zoom in, you'll see a number there. But that, I forget the number of this, but this guitar is in beautiful shape and I'm so happy to get this. You know, the Golden Eagles, They've been going up and up and up. Same, all the Eagles, the Heritage Eagles, classic, up and up. Just like an L5, you know, a few years ago, you could pick them up for five grand all day long. Now you're lucky eight, you know, it's crazy. Things have just gone bonkers. Well, these aren't going to be too far behind. One thing I like about this, as opposed to an L5, it's not quite as fat, it's number one. The, the angle of the headstock is a little steeper, putting more pressure on the nut. I think you get a little more sustain, but you know, we're just, you know, we're talking about guitars that are the top of the heap, and uh, man. They are just really stellar guitars. You know, a lot of people ask about the back pickup. And it's a pretty hot little pickup. And then here's the middle position. But who cares about that? You don't play that. This guitar is meant to be a jazz box, in my opinion. Now, I do have a couple other Golden Eagles, but I'm going to keep this for a while anyways. And um, I just wanted to show it off. Isn't that pretty? <laughs> By the way, this song is called Stella by Starlight. Mm -hmm. 
you know, they come pre-tuned from the factory. And this was damaged in shipping because it's out of tune. Somebody asked me the other day, what do you do for a living? I said, I'm a guitar tuner. They actually believed me. So, <clears throat> because really, I spend half the time playing out of tune, the other half of the time tuning. But anyway. If you ever get a chance, look at the binding on this, on the, on the uh, neck. Beautiful, nice binding. So, so these guitars, you know, this is a copy of an L5, or I don't want to want to say a copy because it's not an exact copy. Uh, Heritage put their own things in it, like the smaller body here, just a little more comfortable. The pitch of the neck, the pitch of the headstock. Of course, the inlays are beautiful, and the logo is beautiful. But it's a stellar guitar. And uh, I just wanted to show it off. You know, I have one with one pickup, and I go back and forth on things. Now, this is Seth Lover pickup, and um, sometimes, you know, you can get them with the HRW uh, Howard Rendell Wall pickups, and those are light. Uh, I really like their a little, um, not as much high end on them, kind of emphasize the low mids. I think it's a nice sound. So anyway, there it is. My new Heritage Golden Eagle. Just wanted to show it off. Okay, I'm going direct through the mixer into the computer. We're gonna go ahead and play it acoustically so you can hear it. I don't quite have the neck adjusted correctly. It's a little too straight right now. But that's all you get acoustically on these, okay? This finish, I think, is a very pretty finish. I like to call it the iced tea finish. Doesn't that look, uh, it's got that light brown iced tea look. And uh, it's a sunburst, so it's an iced tea sunburst. Of course, nowadays, you can't get a new Golden Eagle. Well, you can try, but good luck getting a new one from Heritage. They're focusing in mainly on the Eagle Classics. So, um, there you have it. Rich here again. I just wanted to say thanks for checking out my videos. If you like it, hit the thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and sign up for those notifications so you can see all the cool guitar videos we put out each week. If you want more lessons right now, 
I have hundreds of them at guitarcollegelibrary.com. Check out our low price monthly streaming memberships. And if you want to learn jazz, check out my course, Jazz Guitar Improv. I take beginner jazz players and get them playing awesome solos on the fly. You'll see the link for the JGI course in the description below. Hey, thanks again for watching my channel. We'll see you again real soon with a new video.